guys, it's your girl Vanessa here. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Vanessa. If you're new here, I make natural hair videos, motherhood videos, and fitness videos. So if it's your first time here, thank you so much for stopping by. I would really appreciate it if you can hit that subscribe button and become a member of the family. So let let, let us grow together. And uh, yeah, if you've been watching me from before, thank you so much for the support. I really, really appreciate it. So without rambling too much, let's get into today's video. So today, guys, I'm going to share with you my five superfoods so basically the foods that will grow your hair like crazy if i tell you you have to believe me like all this hair didn't just come from eating junk food okay so there are foods that you can eat that will promote hair growth naturally yes we need to care for our hair but everything starts from the inside so yeah i just thought i'll share with you guys and if you're interested in this video please be sure to keep on watching okay so the food number one or super food number one are eggs okay who would have ever imagined that eggs are a superfood eggs are so full of protein and also full of biotin now protein are very, very important because that's what makes our hair strong now our hair is actually made of um what's it called of a protein itself called keratin and that keratin is actually the building block of our hair so having a diet high enough in protein does increase your chances of having long and thicker hair because the stronger your hair gets the harder it is to break if that makes sense um so definitely make sure you start eating them them eggs foods that are high in protein not only at eggs you can get protein from other sources like nuts seeds meat um beans oh i love beans I, I can eat beans like every single day of the week and i don't mind that now biotin is also one of the things that does help promote hair growth lots of studies have shown that diet high in biotin is absolutely good in promoting that hair growth so make sure you do eat eggs the second superfood are green leafy vegetables now green leafy vegetables not only are good in vitamin a e and c they are also very good in uh, high in iron now iron is particularly important because it's, it's, it helps in the formation of something called hemoglobin and hemoglobin is what carries oxygen in your blood okay so if you have a diet that's high enough in iron or you have a good supply of iron then you're increasing the uh, amount of oxygen that your scalp gets and also you know oxygen is what's needed for reactions to happen for things to happen so essentially you are promoting hand growth in that way if you do eat this this food okay now if you're not iron deficient i would definitely suggest you don't take any iron supplement okay do take the supplement only if you're iron deficient now the other food that are high in iron again are beans like kidney beans uh soya beans uh, we talked about the kale and the spinach almonds uh, peanuts cashew nuts so all of that goody okay now the third superfood are food that are high in vitamin a vitamin c and vitamin e okay now vitamin a is really really important because it helps in the production of something called sebum so sebum is just like that that fat that um that fatty layer that you get on your skin for example like you know how sometimes you just stay like that and your face just gets so oily that's the sebum okay so on our scalp it also produces sebum which is like the natural oil that moisturizes our hair also nourishes the follicle and therefore helps in further hair growth so you want to make sure that you eat enough food that are high in vitamin a so those food include things like pumpkin uh, sweet potatoes carrots so do make sure that you eat those things because they will help in your hair growing in the long in the long run okay now vitamin c and vitamin e are really high um a very good powerful antioxidants now antioxidants are very very important because they fight against free radicals again another big word another big word <laughs> oh my god yeah free radicals the way to understand it is basically something that hinders a reaction from happening so it causes damage so if you can limit or reduce the amount of free radical that you're exposed to or maybe that your body produces um it will definitely help in your general health and also in turn help in that hair growth so again food are high in vitamin c and vitamin e include things like strawberries uh blueberries 
a lemon guava so basically like look for those fruits that are high in these vitamins and trust me in the long run you will see that hair going so fast okay now the fourth uh, superfood are food that are high in vitamin b12 and vitamin d now vitamin b12 is actually a very important vitamin because it helps in the regeneration of cells okay so you want to make sure that you have a, a diet that's high enough in vitamin c because new 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 cells essentially means new growth okay so if you have new growth and that's in terms of hair and if you maintain that length you will definitely see your hair getting fuller and thicker in no time so do make sure so do make sure that you have it that high enough in vitamin b12 uh, food high in vitamin b12 include meat fish like salmon uh shellfish uh beans uh, oh sorry not not beans um uh, peanut cashew nuts almonds um yeah i think i pretty much named most of them but you can also yeah so those are food that you definitely want to make sure you eat on a regular basis because that will definitely help you in the long run if you're a uh, vitamin b12 deficient you can actually uh, ask your gp or your doctor to put you on a supplement and that will definitely help so the last superfood guys but not the least is our food that are high in zinc okay now zinc is one of those things that people don't actually talk about a lot uh, but certainly it has a lot of benefits now zinc has been linked to a condition called alopecia and that's basically when you get like broad patches on your hair like on your scalp or your beard or i mean if you're a man obviously um and basically in other areas where there is hair okay so you just you just get those broad patches where hair that just doesn't grow at all so you want to make sure that your diet is high enough in zinc to prevent that and also studies have shown that um postnatal shedding which happens in every woman after having a baby or does a natural thing you can actually reduce the amount of shedding that you get if you have a diet that's high enough in zinc okay so zinc is very very important and the the food that are high in zinc again include beans uh, again like soya beans kidney beans black beans like all the beans uh, also almonds peanuts cashew nuts meat um shellfish and also some dairy products okay so you just need to check uh perhaps it, uh, the the nutrition information just to see whether there is any zinc in the one that you're picking up okay so um yeah i do hope that you found this helpful now one thing to bear in mind also is that research has shown that excessive amount of stress can cause hair fall and also excessive dieting now if you're dieting too much then you're lacking fat okay your body just starts to lose so much fat and fat is actually needed for the processing of some fat soluble vitamins like vitamin a and vitamin c or e i think um so if you have a diet that's poor in fat or you're losing too much fat even if you eat these foods that are high in these vitamins they're not going to get processed in your that processed in your body properly and in turn that can cause your hair to fall or to thin out so make sure you reduce the amount of stress that you go through i know it's very easy to say but if you can minimize it that would be perfect like exercising is great meditating um music so find ways to help you reduce the amount of stress that you go through and also don't diet too much okay instead of dieting just exercise and focus more on what you eat and you'll definitely see that weight dropping in no time okay so this is it for this video guys if you did enjoy this don't forget to give me a thumbs up and also don't forget to stick around for more videos if you want to see more of me by hitting that subscribe button i keep emphasizing it guys and also don't forget to share my videos guys it will really help me grow like, on this platform okay so do make sure that you uh, share if you find it helpful let your friend know let your sister know you know your mother your grandmother your dog anyone you know that can subscribe okay guys so this is it for this video thank you so much for watching and i'll catch you in my next one bye now